Hey guys, what's going on? It is me, Taffy. Welcome back to Sir You're Being Hunted, which has been on a little bit of a hiatus just because there are so many other games we're playing right now. And I apologize for the, the gap, but it's uh, it's tricky. It's tricky without going to like three videos a day, which I physically just can't handle to get all these done. All right, we know whence last we left this game. Uh, the, I, I, I vaguely remember being in a situation where I was almost instantly having to defend myself. So uh, we'll look for roving bands of dogs. I know we were going to go get food. Uh, F. F. Uh, shoot, I've forgotten this. Uh, uh, I've forgotten the controls. Um, it was F, right? I was uh, in, interact was uh, okay. Cool. So we've cleared that out. There's d inventory, loot, take all. N good, 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 good. All right. So we were going and looking for more ammo. Reload. Man, that almost was disastrous. So we're looking for ammunition. We're looking for a weapon. Um, what is run? Run? Shift. Okay. Cool. Crouch. Crouches. Okay, I've got to, I've got to uh, basically undo all of my Outlast uh, controls for scary game freakiosity. Oh shit. Okay, well we'll go this way then. Uh, shift. Cool. All right. Um, yeah. So it's daytime. This is not Outlast. So frankly, I feel fine playing it. Um, I'm in a situation where I'm not terrified. And it's not spooky in my house. And while I may get beat up and crushed and killed and everything, um, I don't feel nearly as high strung about this game as I used to, which is... Sorry, I heard robots. I heard robots. Uh, if at any point the game gets loud, I apologize. It's just uh, it's the, the sacrifice I have to make to be able to hear, especially while my loud ass is talking over the game itself. Um, okay, so ultimately... Huh. Alright, so we got... I want to be able to get to these houses over here and see if I can find maybe more ammunition. As always, I'm looking for more food. Let's just get in behind the houses while uh, little Lord Fauntleroy is walking the streets of, of Main Street USA here. Oh, it's so creepy. Looks like there's been another update. We've got usables. What the hell? I heard it beep, which means it saw me. How could it have possibly have seen me? Come at me, fats. I will jack you up. I just wanted some chocolatey biscuits. Oh my god. It's like they're inside my head. Yeah, I mean, the headphones on, it's so... Uh, damn you, Astros. I... Uh, you pillowy cushions of absorbing goodness. I'm 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 currently trying to get an Astro sponsorship, so I have to say I, I'm not really, but it sounds like I am. So, uh, F bullets, dubious, dubious, dubious. Okay, cool. You see, I, like it's really nice because this game's an alpha, and you can actually watch things change. It's super cool to me to notice them taking the feedback from the community of, oh man, it's a little too amb. Oh my god, this is a little too ambiguous. This is, you know, I, I don't want to die trying to, to get through all this stuff. Um, so it's nice to see them take all that into account and start to add things like, oh, well, this is dubious. This will get, like, simplifying the game, but not simplifying it so much that it becomes, uh, oh, God. Not simplifying it so much that it becomes easy. Let's see if we can find a different town. Um, up, down, all around. Let's go over and check this town. That's a shout-out if you're an indie game fan. That's me giving mad props to uh, another another cool gamer that if you haven't checked out you probably should. J. Smith OTI. Not that he needs my help. Um, but that said, a lot of my fans are not people that started off in this weird little indie game realm. A lot of my fans are fans that started off as console gamers like me and are following me on this weird journeyman's wander from console gaming to the wonderful realm that is uh, sort of weird androgynous indie PC games. The 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 game's made by people who have long since said, you know what, I don't want to play first-person shooters anymore. I want to come up with my own cool thing that involves first-person shooting of robots. Okay, so we can't strafe and aim down sights at the same time. I was I was sitting here thinking, I was like, if this were Call of Duty, how would I piss off the robots so much that they rage quit? And part of it was like, well, I'd put on uh, my run and stabbing class. But since I don't have a run and stabbing class, um, I would put on my pistol and run around and uh, shoot people from the hip. 
All right, we could use that if we want to cook meat. Do we want to cook meat? Do we, can we cook meat? I right, for inventory. Matches. Uh, I must have gotten... Really? A rugged torch. Okay, well, let's take that and replace the alarm clock in slot one. Weird. I mean, cool, but weird. What do we got in here? Uh, usable... Oh, fruitcake. Yeah, fruitcake never goes bad. And now... I know the that there are things equipable, equipable. Like, see, these are things that I know. I know I'm supposed. Oh, uh, oh dear, raw meat. I could totally cook this. I'm not in. A, uh, I guess I do need to eat a little bit. Hey, yeah, use the pickled eggs. Yeah, see, that took. That, I feel good because that took me up to 99 percent and not to a full hundred. Um, I don't want to start this fire at night. I don't know if night versus day makes any difference. I feel like it should, and I feel like the people who made this game are probably smart enough to have taken that into account. I don't know how I feel about being out in the open like this. I guess there's tall grass right here. Oops. Uh, crouch. That's virtually 0% visibility. Crouch back up. Alright. As long as we're out here, I mean, we're, we're on the outskirts. Um, we haven't really collected anything, but I will save just to put us in a different spot so we don't start off near that summoning stone. I'm probably going to try for the most part to complete an island before I go on to another one. Well, this is inconvenient. Um, I, I mean, I could totally go from one island to the next, but I don't, I don't really see the point of it. There are a it. number of islands in the archipelago. Each of them is likely to have fragments of the device for you to collect. Try not to get lost. Thanks, Jeeves. We'll save, and we'll go back to the game. Cool. The wisps are still kind of ambiguous. I'm still pretty sure that those are taking us to something, but at the same time, if they're taking us to fragments, uh, we've got the device, the 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 thingamalocator, as I'm gonna call it, the thingamalocator. Uh, 100% a gives away our position, which is really cool. Uh, oh right, these assholes. Man, I'd have to be a fucking crack shot. I don't know, can they, if they can't get out of the bear trap, I could trap one, kill the other. What was that? That's a noise I haven't heard before. Oh, wait. More fragment parts. No, oh, but I hear robots. In the words of Zoidberg, I hear robots. I think the game is done giving us uh, giving us fragments for free. All right, let's see if we can get this one. We got five shots. That's two shots per robot. I feel like we can make these count. Sorry, I'm getting quite locked onto the mouse here. Do I have anything that's distracting? Uh, let's see. Inventory. Could drink a stout and then throw the bottle. Let's do that. And then we'll... Oh. Yeah. Maybe that's not as loud as I thought it was. Run, run, run. Oh god, I think when, you, when they lose your sight, that it clicks off of them now. You can hear that beep. We're swimming. Ooh, the water here is uh, scummy at best. Wow, I think we pulled that off. Ooh, what is that? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What the hell? Get out of the water. Get out of the water. Oh my god, get out of the water! Get out of the water! No! What the actual hell? What the actual hell? Huh. 
Ho! Okay, uh, so the designers have figured out a way to keep you from going into the water. Wow! I was wondering what the sound was. Does that happen every time we touch the water? Oh my god. That was terrifying. Well, I don't think throwing a bottle is going to trick that thing. Jesus, God. Do we go for the twofer? Some of me thinks stealth. Some of me thinks get it and run. We did already get the, the piece from here, and we killed the robots here. What the hell? All right. Let's see if we can just cut pretty much straight. Uh, there is another piece here. There is another fragment. And this would give us access to move around this area. Not with impunity, but we wouldn't have to worry as much about the robots that are watching the... What is this? The northwest part of... The north by northwest part of town? The west by northwest part of town? Where are these guys? I have a hard time believing that these guys are... ados -ed. Shit. I had a window and I think I missed it. Alright, well we'll, well, we'll study these guys' patterns for a second. While I gather myself after being attacked by that shit from War of the Worlds. Oh. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate that uh, these guys apparently went on a piss break and I missed my opportunity to snatch this fragment. That said, I probably, I probably would have had to have gone on a dead sprint. I don't think I could have gotten that and gotten away without being seen on that tremendously open line of sight. These guys are on rotations, man. These guys are on patrols. I might be able, if they go back to town, I might be able to run in, snatch this, and get back out. Let's see what they're up to. They're splitting up. Oh, come on. Nope. All right. Well, let's just take this one back. We'll take this one back to the to the standing stones. We'll just outrun these guys for now. There's part of me who wants to bait them out and kill them, but I, I've only got five bullets. It seems like a bad idea. We'll just hide here for a second. Visibility zero. That's good. Is that more smoke? No. That seems like it's the only one that's picking up right now. Sounds safe. Let's let's move out. I think there's our standing stone. Feels pretty open. I think we can go ahead and get this fragment back. So, well, you know, one more fragment down. We're making progress. Not crazy progress, but we're working. What are they shooting at? Are they shooting birds? I don't understand. I'm putting the kettle on now, sir. We'll have you home in no time. Yeah, I believe it when I see it, Jeeves. Alright. I'm curious about what they're shooting, but I don't know if I'm curious enough to go get murked. Alright, well, uh, screw it. That's that will go that way. That seems to be the the obvious next choice. And we'll figure... Uh, you know what? Let's try the other way. Let's go the almost exact opposite direction and just see what happens. Because we know what's waiting for us over there. We're probably going to need ammunition to deal with that. Ah, uh, shit. That's, uh, that's a roaming party. That's dogs. Yeah, that's at least a dog and two dudes. They could be guarding something. They might not. It doesn't, oh, it doesn't change the fact that I don't like being out in the open like this. Another roaming party going through the city. Roaming parties suck. Well, you know what? I said we were going to go this way. Let's not. Let's go this way. We'll go southwest since we just went northwest. Uh, and maybe we can find... I mean, it's all... For right now, until we find more ammunition, until I get an axe or something, it's all about the path of least resistance. 
Um, ah. Hmm. All right. A lot of Dota 2 friends on right now. All right, well, let's do this. All right, so that becomes an empty bottle. Maybe we can use that to get our hands on uh, hands on another fragment. Oh shit. Get back into the thick here. It looked like that balloon was heading this way. It is. We'll wait till this passes. The uh, the visibility thing is a l is a lot more. Uh, there's much more minutia to it. There, there it's much more uh, gradual. It used to just be like you're 100 percent visible, and then it would stop, and then it would be like. No, dude, you're totally gone. And be like, but I only moved like an inch. And this seems like a much more gradual disappearance of the visibility bar. Like, there's a faint, faint circle now before, which I don't think you saw uh, in the past. So they're they're actively working to make this a play a more playable game. Uh, my biggest problem with it early on was that I was just like, man, this is just kind of too intense. Like, I'm just kind of a casual gamer, and I don't know if I can deal with you know how hardcore this game wants to be. So they're they're taking away some of the hardcore elements without making it simplistic like as you can see I'm having a hard time really moving anywhere right now oh shit let's murder this guy if he comes over here doesn't look like he's gonna come over here still I think we might murder this guy is there more than one there's bound to be more than one yeah there's two I want a shotgun. If I could get a shotgun, my life would be... Ah, oh, there's three. Well, shit, where do I go? Where can I go? I guess we'll start off with here. Are they following me? No. Okay. Sorry, I just I hear sounds, so I know stuff's around. I'll be damned if I can tell you exactly where, though. We'll take cooked rabbit. Is that a roving band? I feel like that's a roving band. At least the the cool the cool part about this game and the like really annoying part about this game is that there's no music, which makes it irritating because it's so uh, wrenching. Seriously, get it! Don't stop, brother. Get it. Um. Um. Whoops. Oh, right. Uh, I need two spots open. Uh, biscuits are gone. Use. There. Uh, there. Move the rabbit up. Cool. I don't think we're going to see very many free fragments just floating around. I'm glad we bumped into that one. I don't know what those guys are guarding. Like, those guys over by this house over here? Probably another fragment, but it just doesn't... It feels weird that we got that one so easy. I feel like we're going to be punished for that, and I don't know how. I feel better about moving around now. Um, not great. It is broad daylight, and I don't think anybody's really around. I might actually cook this meat as long as we're sitting here by a fire. Let's do this fast. I know you're not used to preparing your own meals, sir. But I'm sure you can master roasting game on an open fire. That smoke can be seen for miles, however, so do be quick. Okay.
All right, now I gotta get out of here. Okay, cool. So we, we lit it, and now we run away. Okay, so cool. We know that now. We know that if we light a fire, the, the we're gonna instantly have to deal with like hot air balloons nearby coming. Yep, they're converging on it. Okay, so we really have to be quick when we do that. Like, that's no bullshit. We might be able to use that as a distraction. Like, if we want to draw those guys away from that house, uh, I don't know if that works, but we could light that fire, and then maybe they go that direction instead, and we go rob them blind while they're looking at the fire. That's interesting. I never thought about fire as a distraction. Now we just have to be safe about getting out of here, because we only have five rounds. I don't know what they're shooting. I'm so curious, but I don't want to stick my head up. There's no more crows. You hear that? All the birds just got quiet. I think they shot... They're shooting any, like, moving, organic, loud matter. See, now I hear, now I hear crows again. They shot a whole bunch of times, and then... Maybe maybe that's the balloon. Maybe that's snipers in the balloon, shooting like birds in live games, live game and stuff. I don't know, man. I'm still really new to this game, despite having, you know, technically had it on the channel for a long time. I just I don't I don't play it very often, but it's getting to that point uh, the point where I want to. I didn't really want to before because it was so intense, and now I'm finding myself drawn to this game because they're taking away the parts that make it. Unplayable was the wrong word, but I wasn't willing to be so gung-ho. Like, you really have to get me invested in a game to want to spend the kind of time that they wanted me to spend. I'd have to, like, I would have had to have edited out big chunks of time where I've just wandered for no good reason. So I feel like they're... Excellent. We're making progress. You might survive this after all. So I feel like they've taken away a lot of the aspects that made this game like so tough to play that it wasn't something I thought I would enjoy and now I feel like I might enjoy it again all right let's let's go back and see if maybe we can make some progress on oh did I save let's save as long as we're in the general region let's save it used to be that this was all fenced off too and now it's a place where robots can just wander through which really worries me because I'm worried about spawning into like a random patrol uh, which is gonna be instant death for me but I guess you know it's no big deal if I can just resave again ooh I'm enjoying myself right now ah uh, god dang it stupid stupid balloons making it tough to move around that's fine I'm actually encouraged by the fact that I don't see any blip on there right now because it means that we can maybe investigate this house. No, there's a there's a fragment. Let's get to the far outer edge here and see if we can circle it. Which means I got to be careful to watch to my left too. But I mean that's I've made that mistake before where I'm just like trying so hard to skirt an enemy that I walk into another enemy. Oh my god, roving party. Get in the tall grass, tall grass. Stay in the stay in the ditch. Stay in the tall grass, stay in the depressions. Was it a uh, World War II they used to say defilade? Blow up a hole in the ground and use defilade. Def de defecate. Defa defecalifragilistic expialidocious. What is that noise? What? Ah! The hell? Ah! Oh my god, what? That's terrifying! 
No! Ah! Jesus! Oh my god. What is going on with this game right now? I feel stupid because I just wasted all my bullets on it too. I didn't know if I could kill it. I wanted to. Oh no. What was that? That couldn't have been real. Oh my god. Sorry, hold on one second. I gotta check the time. 26 minutes? We're getting close. We're getting close. Oh my god, what was that? I got goosebumps, man. That's not right. That's not really part of the game. Are you serious right now? Although I did notice when I put Sir You're Being Hunted in and I adjusted the volume, the icon right now is like a robot pumpkin. So they're obviously doing some Halloween stuff to be creepy as balls. Huh. <sighs> behind you. Oh, I'm gonna hear that in my nightmares. That is the stuff that's liquid terror and it's just a bloody scarecrow. I don't know. That... Oof. That calls for a... calls for a canned pie. It was some sort of tracker. The fact that it was like existed in some corporeal state in some ethereal teleportation X-Men bullshit uh, made it that much stranger alright well we're safe for now that was terrifying and now I feel stupid for having dumped all my bullets into it but can you blame me? in all honesty I mean if you had a gun and out of nowhere a really creepy over here behind you scarecrow showed up and started taunting you from like two feet away would you not have shot it five times and then pistol whipped it there's no pistol whip option so I guess we're back to you know stealth but oh my god like I have tingling in my thighs right now good on you big robot that was terrifying as shit your game has become easier and terrifying at the same time. I applaud you. Oof. Alright, well I'm going to try to do something. I don't know exactly what that is. I'd like to accomplish something. I don't know what. I need more ammo, but it's actually been really difficult to get in to a town right now. I can't deal with, I can't deal with three dudes, man. Is that some sort of inn or tavern? It feels like a new structure. I don't think I've seen that before. Um... There's very clearly a fragment over there, but I'll be damned if I can get... Ooh. Hello, hello. How are you, love? You look lonely. What may I do to help you? How may I be of service? I would like, very much so, to put you in my pocket and walk away. Would that sound agreeable to you? Wonderful. My name's Moss. Excellent. There are some easy fragments, which uh, was another complaint I had. I've always, I always felt like I was never making progress in this game because every fragment was guarded by like eight robots and I only ever had like a rock and a pistol. And I always felt kind of uh, hornswoggled by that. I always felt kind of... Uh, I always felt kind of duped. Sorry, every once in a while I have to pause and sort of take notice of my surroundings. I know that DayZ players do the same thing where they commentary, 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 pause, meerkat, 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 commentary, 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 pause, meerkat, meerkat, meerkat. So I had to take my second of meerkat there, especially because now I have no um, ammunition left. As a matter of fact, what? I don't think I can carry it. They're all, all the fragments seem to be monstrous now. There used to be little shards too, and now they don't seem to so much be the case anymore. Oh, I see you. Shaking that ass. Alright, well, if it's a big fragment, we can't carry it. And frankly, right now, we, we still need to do a town run, but I don't know really how to accomplish that yet. 
Oh my god. The Scarecrow, man. What the hell? What the hell was that all about? I don't want to go in tall grass again. That was terrifying. My balls tingled. Hmm. Now I'm out of ammo. Which drastically reduces my options. That's okay, though. Good on them. That was fun. That was an interesting little tweak to throw at me. We'll go ahead and put in this fragment and we'll save. We'll kind of take inventory of where we are. And uh, we'll come back next time and hopefully get into town. Otherwise, we'll just keep grabbing fragments and running our asses off. Excellent. We're making progress. You might survive this after all. Cool beans, man. Um, Alright, so let's... Let's save. Uh... Quit to main menu. Did I save? Let's save. Let's save just to be sure. Save again. I'd hate to lose progress, man. Alright. So now we know we saved. Quit to main menu. Oh, okay. Well, shoot. Apparently there's been some sort of Halloween update to Sir You're Being Hunted, which I can now bring the volume way down on. Uh... uh yeah, I, I don't have a choice. Um... Oh, man, oh, man. Apparently there's been some sort of Halloween update. Now there's some creepy haunted robot... Scarecrow that lurks in the tall grass, which used to be the safest place, and now I don't know if that thing can hurt me, but I didn't like how it was all up on me like a drunken frat boy at a house party. Um, we did manage to get three fragments on this trip uh, in a half an hour, which I think is ridiculous good. So um, I hope you enjoyed. Expect to see more Sir You're Being Hunted, especially, like I said, now that the game is becoming more accessible and easier to play, uh, and a lot less of, a, of an enigma wrapped in a riddle stuffed inside of a mystery. It's the Turducken. It's the Turducken of wonder. Now that some of the, the, the ambiguity around it has been lifted, the shroud's been lifted, um, this game is, is much easier to play, and I think I'll probably do more of it. Either way, man, thanks for tuning in. I had a blast on this one. I uh, look forward to more Sir You're Being Hunted. I think what I might try to do is two videos during the week, three on the weekends, because uh, I just I have so much content right now, and there's just uh, there's not enough hours in the day. Uh, but in the meantime, thank you guys for tuning in. On behalf of the Mr. Wolfles channel in the cave, my name is Taffy, and I am out.